Wednesday morning off the Beverly Hills. Me and Jay are taking a bike ride there. He's got a meeting and then we're gonna grab some coffee, come back and hit the gym. It's 2pm, we're heading back from Beverly Hills. I've just bought a taco truck and I'm gonna break, where is it? There it is. I'm gonna break my fast and get two tacos. Let's do it. These look so good. Just got my tacos. You are not gonna believe how good these look. We've got the sweet potato taco here and then we have the shredded pork. LA street food at its best. God. Oh my god, that sweet potato. It's got some cheese on top. Crunchy, crunchy nuts as well. Look at that. Oh my days. I can probably do like five boxes of these. These are, these are insane. Big flavor fest. We've got like them crispy pork, omelette. Cheese, avocado, sweet potato, it is heaven. If you like Mexican food, hit up the taco trucks in LA. Okay, let's do it. Back from the bike ride, literally dead. Two hours of riding the bike, must have burnt like, I don't know, 800, 1000 calories. Gonna head over to the gym now and just do a little workout. I mean like, a little bit of vanity stuff, arms, maybe a bit of abs. Workout's done, heading back to the gaff, gonna make my chocolate protein oats and then get back to work. Post-workout refuel, got my chocolate oats, banana, cinnamon and a little bit of syrup. 6.50 at my desk, finishing off some work, about to sign out from the vlog, but before I do, I wanna have a quick talk about a new mindset that I feel that I've been working on or stumbled across or whatever, or I've achieved in the last month or two. And it's basically like a newfound freedom to me and it involves two main things. Number one, not caring about what other people think and truly not caring about what other people think because it's quite trendy, isn't it, these days to say like zero fucks given, I don't care about this, I don't care about that. But those kind of same people are posting on Instagram or Facebook or whatever and then checking back every five minutes. I've even heard people saying like, if they don't get a certain amount of likes, within an hour they're gonna delete the photo. That's not zero fucks, that's wanting validation from an external source. And, you know, I've been guilty of that too. When I first started putting out content online and vlogging and doing social media for my business, I really cared what people thought and I really checked back to see what was going on. And in the last few months or six months, I really, really, really fucking don't care. I put out vlogs because I enjoy doing it. It's hard work, you know, there's editing, there's shooting, there's lots of stuff that goes on behind the scenes, but I enjoy doing it. I put it out for the sense of achievement and I like putting out content that helps people, that inspires people, and it's great. If someone leaves a message, emails me and said they like the vlog, of course, I've got an ego. I like that, but I don't need that. I don't need people to tell me what I'm doing is okay. I know that what I'm doing is enjoyable, I like it, and it's helping achieve my goal and grow my business. Also, the other thing would be not being attached to results. Too many of us set a goal but become really attached. And that could be anything. That could be like a weight loss goal or making money or you know um, a strength goal or whatever. And you, it has to be this way. When you become attached to results, negativity, self-doubt, all this stuff can creep in. It can really mess you up. So people can hear that and say, what are you talking about? You don't care. You don't, you don't put any effort in. The complete opposite. You go 100% in on your goals and you do everything you can. Because if you're doing that, there's no time to worry. And you don't need to worry because you're doing everything you can. You should be worrying if you've got a goal but you're not working towards it. So by letting go of outcomes and just focusing on good work ethic, putting in the work towards your goal, there's so much freedom there. And also really giving zero fucks about what other people think is going to free you so, so much. Put, you can put content out, you can dress how you want, you can say what you want. As long as you know that you're being a good person on the whole, you've got nothing to worry about. So that's my thoughts on freedom in life. Those two things have really, really helped me and I hope you can apply them too. 
see how it goes. Okay, I'm gonna have dinner, finish off some work, and then have an early night. See you tomorrow.